Okay, we're back. We talked uh, in the last video about how to basically get your domain, uh, your website hosted with Bluehost.com, which is the hosting company I use. There's a bunch out there, so shop around, get whatever you think's best. Um, but here is your social media rock star. But as you can see, the the page itself is is boring, plain. Uh, just doesn't look any good, right? So this isn't what you're going to do. So what you want to do is you want to get a theme. You want to get a theme in installed here. This is WordPress, as I said, is the type of blog that I use. Uh, WordPress is a is a free blog. Doesn't cost you anything. It's got lots of different plugins that you can buy and whatnot. But here, we're, this video, we're focusing on themes. We need to get a nice little theme up there pretty up our website make it look good so let's go to themes and you know you can it's up to you here's sort of your default screen right now you see here it says current theme and it gives you a little idea how you can pretty it up um, or you can um, basically what some people would do and what I've done before on some blogs is you know install themes and you can search. You can search for the different kinds of themes that you might want to use. The different colors. You may want two column, a two column blog. You may want a four column blog. And you can just go search. Um, one thing I always like to look for is a custom header. So I can put a nice custom header on there. Um, you know, custom background, those kinds of things. So, but look, you may find something that you like, but those are the things I look for custom. Now, you can also search for the newest the newest uh, themes that are out there and get a look or like oh there's quite a quite a few options here you know that looks cool or scroll down you go that looks cool or whatever um, I sort of like this one with the little color bars in there but um so you know you can look at those you can look at the ones that have been recently updated there's also some featured ones you can look at um, those kinds of things you know that looks pretty cool you can you know doctor any of these pages up so you just choose what you like here's a good one if you have a you know sort of a cakes or cookies cupcakes kind of thing this looks more like you know media publication type style so you know it's really up to you now the other thing I like to do is you know go to go to let me see if I can get a Google search going here Mojo Themes, which is another website that I like, you know, premium WordPress, premium, there, so you stand out, be a little bit different, uh, spend a little money, uh, this is your presence, it's like your online business card, so spend a little money, and they got all these themes that you can, you know, your business theme, e-commerce, magazine, you know, say you want a, uh, say you got a, uh, you're starting a restaurant, and they've got all these restaurant themes that you can look for, so spend some time, you know, spend about an hour on this site, look around, see what you like, blah, blah, blah. It's all sorts of things you can search in here. But anyway, find something you like, and then here. Now, I've already found one I've liked, and it's, I'll show you real quick. It's the template I use for my website, which is attorneysteve, attorneysteve.net. Well, no, that probably isn't the site I'm looking for. So HTTP colon slash slash. Let's try that. Okay, hopefully that comes up. Okay, and as you see, we're we're in e-business, real estate, intellectual property law, doing you know internet law and those kinds of things. So um, trade and trademarks is a is a big part of what we um, big part of um, our interest level here. So okay, and brands. Are you doing working with your brands online? So anyway, so this is my theme, and as you can see, it's got all my social icons up there. It's got my links, my pages, uh, link to my Attorney Steve show. Um, and here's neat, because you can put a bunch of little videos in here, which I think is pretty cool. And you can scroll down. It has a nice little bottom area that has your recent video. I mean, and I customized all this. Don't get me wrong. I customized all this. So, so, But it's a really nice theme that I like, and I'm familiar with it. So I'm going to use that. It's called the Socialite theme from WordPress, and feel free to use that. And, but I'm just going to upload, okay? Because I already got it. So I'm going to upload it. Choose your file. So the, it's already uploaded on my hard drive here. So let's just go Socialite. And I'm looking for my zip file. 
uh, hopefully it'll come up here, socialite 3.2.zip. So I'm just going to take that, boom, and let's try install now. Let's hope this works. You never know with, with technology. And then it says theme installed successfully. So we're just going to activate it, right? Got to activate it. There it is, premium WordPress theme. Now we're talking. Now we're cooking with gas. And, and we'll talk in the next section about how you uh, customize it and all the fun things you can do with it. But let's just go back to our home page. And let's see what we got. So as you can see, that boring page has now turned into a template that is very promising and that we're obviously we're going to have to do some work on it because it certainly doesn't look like my attorneysteve.net site but that's that's the fun of building your website so we'll get to that in the next video thank you for listening to this one and we will be right back